Leha is an Indonesian word. Indonesia, like New Zealand, being on a plate margin and home to numerous volcanoes. A twitch cracked the wall of the crater lake. 35,000 cubic meters of water were ready to leave. And when that happened, a highly mobile gunge of ash, rocks, boulders and water started to surge downhill. Those people who've seen a layar often describe it like watching a river of wet concrete on the move. At this spot, the Leha from Mount Ruapehu was doing 60 kilometers an hour, loaded with volcanic ash, tree trunks, and very likely most of these boulders. It was heading straight for a railway bridge just around the corner. The bridge was no match for the Leha. It was swept away in a matter of seconds just before a train arrived. 151 people were killed. Since it was first put forward, the theory of plate tectonics has always said that volcanic activity isn't the only product of plate movements. There's another major drama in the Earth's crust which has a very direct effect on people, like here in the town of Franz Josef, which sits right on top of a plate boundary. It's a transform boundary, with the Pacific plate on this side of the road moving that way, and the Indian Australia the other. Thank <laughs> you. 